Welcome back to our Facebook Live viewers. This is the Mitsubishi Big Show 2017, and we're down to the top 10 in the Can-Am 11s. It is the short go, proudly sponsored by our friends at Harvey Morris Motorcycles. And who are the teams, Mr. Sean O'Hanlon? Well, Larry, just bear with me here for a moment as we go through them in their draw order. They're going to run here in the final tonight from, fast, from slowest qualifier, I should say, through to fastest. And here is how they look. A gentleman that's visited us here from the United States this week, Mitch, Mitch Waldersberger, is going to turn one around for Matthew Speedy. They were 34.17 seconds on their three steers coming into the final, and they'll rope first. Second out, we're going to see James Maguire Spaulding and Steve Augustine. They were 33.9 on their three steers. Next up, we got Natalie and Heath Kimber. They were 33.36 on their three. They're um, really a team to watch. I tell you what, when the Kimber family's hot, they're really hot. Um, the fourth into the final is Peter Hutchins with Dale Caben. Well, of course, Dave, Dale was a champion here last year in this event and drove home a brand new Mitsubishi Triton. They were 31.95 seconds last year. And the last one that I'm going to introduce before giving them to you, Larry, is young Kobe Miller, a young fellow I've been watching for many, many years. He's going to be on the heading horse and he's going to turn one around for his wonderful partner in Clay Bush. There's the rest of them there, mate. All right, as we go to our fifth fastest qualifier coming in, Wayne Slater and Jackson Denning will pair up. They had a three-head total of 29.21 seconds on the three runs. Our fourth fastest, James Maguire Spaulding, has the rodeo bloodline running deep through the veins alongside of David Brown. He had a three-head total of 28.12. Then it was a family side of things. It's Clint and Dally Tills from North Queensland. Three head total at 27.16 coming in. They are our third fastest on three head. Peter Hutchins gets a second trip, a second chance of the big piece of the pie. He pairs up with Shane Kenny with the second fastest coming in on three head with a 21.32 run. And our fast team coming in, leading by a little bit of a comfort seat. But I tell you what, you can't stub your toe because things will go wrong. And I can guarantee you in team roping, it can. It can come up with one foot or a no head catch. 19.44 on three head. Jesse Townsend and Thomas Whitwell, they're in the driver's seat. Let's get to the Harvey Morris Motorcycles short go competition in the Can-Ams, number 11. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get a little bit of fair income. Let's get into the big money, the big prizes, the Mitsubishi motor cars. Let's get into the Navajo trailers. Hey, Mitch Waldersberger, outside right now with Matt Speedy. Oh, goodness me, sir. Well, 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 he's traveled thousands of miles to join us here this week. Let me tell you, sir, it's been our pleasure to have you along, Mitch. Thank you so much for joining us here at the Mitsubishi Big Show. All right, as we go to our ninth fastest team coming in, 33.9 on three head. James Maguire spalling has got a quick head catch. Pairs up with Steve Augustine on the hind set. Picks up one foot in the field. They've got five at the line as well. So it'll be a plus 10 to a time of 6.01 to a 16.01 officially on the books. 49.91 on four head. As we go to our next team, our eight fastest qualifiers. Yeah, they are, Larry. Hey, Natalie Kimber and Heath Kimber make their way into the box. They were 33.36 on three after three. All the threes have lined up. Let's see what Natalie and Heath Kimber can put together right now here in our number 11's final. Natalie gets one on around the corner. Come on, Heath Kimber. Slide in and slide in and pick up two. Well done, sir. 
There's a qualified time on the board, an 8.20. They were clean through the barrier. They were clean in the field for an 8.20. That gives them a 41.56, a 41.56. As we go to Peter Hutchins, he pairs up with Dale Cabin. He's got a couple of chances for a big piece of the pie in the Harvey Morris motorcycle short round for the Can-Am number 11s. He qualifies in on 31.95 on three head, but the head loop on this occasion goes to the ground. It will be no change for that team of Peter Hutchins and Dale Cabin. Well, well, well. As the pressure mounts, as we get deeper in, let's have a look down there at the... Let's have a look down there at the roping box for Kobe Miller and Clay Bush. This particular team was 30.28. They were 30.28 coming into the final of the 11s here. The young man calls Warwick home. Kobe Miller. Oh boy, he's gone for a fish, gone for a fish. Around the corner comes Clay Bush. Set a trap, catch a cow, but no joy there on the, f on the front end, unfortunately for young Kobe. Kobe and Clay leave with a no time. All right, and then we were down to our five fastest teams coming in. This is Wayne Slater and Jackson Denning. Jackson supported by Ron Jones, Haulage on the third party. Chance for a big bonus, 29.21 on three coming in. We've got the head catch on, slip it down, pull up a pair on the back end. We're clean on the run, a 7.47, ladies and gentlemen, as we see a leaderboard change. Thirty-six point six eight. They are your new average leaders right now. Wayne Slater and Jackson Denning. As we go down to our fourth fastest team qualifying. James Maguire Spalding backs into the head box. David Brown into the head in, into the heel box. Twenty-eight point one two. They were. Come on! Oh goodness me! James Maguire Spalding jumped out there and got it on to go to the lead, and then it all seemed to go south. Them's the brakes, and unfortunately, the boys leave with a no time. Well, ladies and gentlemen, if you're joining us on the Facebook Live feed, make sure you like us, share the pages. This is just a taste of the action over the next couple of days as well as the big show continues. But right now, we are in serious business mode. The Harvey Morris Motorcycle Short Round with the pairing of Clint and Dally Tills from North Queensland. They're coming in on three head with 27.16. As we wait for the header to be in position, watch for the nod of the head to signify the start of the run. Big bucks on offer in the Can-Am number 11s. Big presentation to follow tonight. We're halfway there. Young Daly moves in for the heel trap, sneaks it under, puts it and holds it. Clean as a run. 9.28, 9.28. We'll wait for the girls to give us the numbers on four. Well, 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 36.44 after their 9.28. That puts them into the lead by some 24 hundredths of a second. Here's a pair of men that want to make a change to that. Pete Hutchins, Shane Kenny. They were 21.22, uh, 21.32, sorry. Coming into the final. Only two teams left to rope before we find out who's going to be crowned the 2017 number 11 champions. Peter Hutchins, and get, Hutchins gets outside. Shane Kenny waits for a trap. Oh, boy, oh, boy. The pressure has just mounted, ladies and gentlemen. A 7.00. For a 28.32, well, 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 goodness me. 
What do they need? The last team, it's down to this, ladies and gentlemen, Jesse Townsend and Thomas Whitwell. They had a little cushion, and I tell you what, the front seat is getting very, very tight right now. 19.44 on three head coming in. They need to be better than 8.8. .8. Let's do this. Two great mates, they've rodeoed, they've team roped all over the countryside. Jesse Townsend, Thomas Whitwell can do this. He's got the fans in the background. This is it. All or nothing. This is a big one. Plenty of cash on offer, plenty of prizes on offer in the Harvey Morris motorcycles. Let's go down, let's go dirty. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hang in the mix, hang in the mix. Stretches them out. We got five in the field. Mr. Daly on the back end. 12.44 plus five. A 17.44 on the time. 36.88 will drop them down in the payouts to about fourth, it looks like. But ladies and gentlemen, Sean O'Hanlon in the Harvey Morris Motorcycle Short Round. Who are the winners? Well, Larry, it looks like at this stage, it's going to be Peter Hutchins and Shane Kenny take away first place with a 28.32 on four after four. Four. We will come back in a little while, ladies and gentlemen, with the official results. And don't forget our presentation tonight as well. We will be getting underway, underway with that very, very soon. So congratulations to all our number 11 ropers who have roped well here this weekend.